G'day, welcome to Oz Tool Talk. I'm Dwayne. Today I'm reviewing uh, a DeWalt FlexVolt tool. This is a 54 volt SDS Max rotary hammer drill, the DCH481. Uh, DeWalt also have an SDS Plus, just the regular um, on their 54 volt line, but this is the big dog. And this one is directly modeled on DeWalt's electric five kilogram SDS Max drill. Uh, this one over here is the D25, 481. Um, it weighs in at 5.9 kilos, the electric unit. The cordless one is 6.4 with a battery on, so an extra half a kilo. But they're really, they're almost identical. They've got the same shell, they've got the same bit holder. Um, the handle's similar, but not exactly the same. Um, you can tell that, as DeWalt have told me, it's directly modeled off it. And it's really exciting that battery tech is getting us to the point now where you can take a 1050 watt electric tool and just adapt it for a battery and away you go. So their specs are identical, 3150 beats per minute and uh, 6.1 joules per impact. So um, they should perform the same, even though that kind of blows my mind and I'm still a bit skeptical. I'm gonna go out now uh, to my cousin's place and drill into a bunch of sleepers and uh, see if this really is as powerful as this big five kilo electric unit. That's a 20 mil bit.
so this is a, a really powerful tool. Um, I must admit I haven't used a lot of these big sort of category rotary hammer drills before, five kilo, seven kilo, anything like that. Um, so this really blew me away. To have a 32 mil bit in here and to be able to just chow through, those sleepers were 40 MPA concrete. Um, it was pretty amazing to me. It's rated for 40 mil, so um, I should get myself a 40 mil bit and have a play, but um, well, it, it's absolutely true. This unit is identical to the electric unit, the, the 1050 watt unit. Um, I think in the 20 mil holes, the electric one by a few seconds, in the 32 mil hole, the cordless one by a few seconds, but they feel the same. Um, they, they feel the same power, the same comfort. They just feel like you're using the same unit. One's got a cord, one doesn't. Um, and uh, I tell you what, coming from much smaller units, this big unit here is so comfortable. I guess maybe the extra weight helps, but really the vibration control on these tools were just really nice. You could just hold on to it for ages. Um, I've used some pretty high-end cordless rotary hammer drills before, um, and uh, both big ones and small ones, and uh, I've never drilled a hole that big so comfortably. It's just, I'm really, really impressed by that. Um, so in terms of price and such, I think the unit on itself is about 750 bucks in Australia. When you buy it in a kit with a couple of nine amp hour batteries, it costs 1150. Um, so actually not quite as much as I would have thought given, uh, given its competition and um, you know, how powerful this unit is. The nine amp hour batteries, you really need them. Um, I showed you pretty much all the footage that I did with this unit and I, I drained the battery on that so I did five 20 mil holes, two 32 mil holes. Um, I broke up half a sleeper, so that's probably 1.2 meters of, of an 80 mil sleeper. And then a tiny bit of chipping um, on the steel work with a little concrete in, it, in, the, in the sleeper factory. Um, and that was it, the battery was done. So this really sucks the juice. And that's not surprising if it's, you know, if it's keeping up with a thousand watt unit. So you definitely want those nine amp hour batteries and you're definitely gonna want a second one. Um, to, tr to change it out. Luckily, the FlexVolt kits come with their fast charger. Um, but yeah, I think that this is kind of like the grinder um, in that if you use it to its full extent, like really heavy duty tasks, um, you're gonna kill the battery pretty fast um, with these sort of tools. Um, so yeah, I mean, there's not much else to say. Uh, it was really comfortable, it was really powerful, um, and I just loved using it. I loved using this FlexVolt tool. Um, and um, Mike and I are hoping to do a high voltage rotary hammer drill comparison soon. I'm not sure whether we'll have this one in or the SDS Plus version, but um, I'm expecting the Flex Vault to put in a really good effort. Um, and uh, yeah, it might be a, a hot favorite for that comparison when it comes out. So anyway, please stay tuned. This was the DCH481 DeWalt's new SDS Max rotary hammer drill. Uh, we'll see you next time. Please comment, please subscribe, please like. Catch you later.